We are back in our itty bitty bikini era. My boobs are not that big. Oh yes, the purple. It's only basically covering my nipples. Are we digging this? Cause I'm digging this. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. We are manifesting warmer weather and I have a airy swimsuit try on haul for you today. If you live in Calgary, Alberta, Canada, or you have seen some of my other videos, you know that we had a brutally cold winter here in Calgary. There were some days that dropped below minus 50 degrees Celsius. Coldest I have ever felt. Now, I don't have any plans to go anywhere soon. Now that the sun is out for longer, the sun is warmer, the snow is melting, I am ready to do this airy try on swimsuit haul for you today. I'm not gonna lie, I have a lot of stuff. I might have purchased it last month when I saw a massive sale. They came out with a bunch of new styles for 2024 and I jumped on that sale. It was probably a little bit of retail therapy on one of those cold days, but I felt that it's finally warm enough, the sun is shining, that I was gonna do the try on haul for you today. I barely remember what I got, so I gotta check my notes and we're gonna go through the pieces one by one. Now I would say that I'm in my itty bitty bikini era again. I definitely was in this era in my 20s. And even while pregnant, I continued wearing my bikinis, but then I there was a drop off after having my kids not because I was uncomfortable with what my body looked like I still feel a little uncomfortable with what my body looks like after having kids it was mostly due to the fact that I was always getting in the water with my babies with my toddlers and wearing an itty-bitty bikini I always just kind of get a little bit scared that you know things are gonna slip down gonna constantly be having to adjust but now it is 2024 my kids are three and four so I am back in my era and I'm here for it. The reason I wanted to do a try on haul for you is because I have googled many many times over the past few years try on hauls for swimsuits but I rarely find someone that has a body type like mine and the reason I say that is because I have very very little going on up here. In my last video which was my Gymshark haul you saw that I really struggle with sports bras because everything kind of makes me look flat up top which is fine because I am flat up top especially in a bikini I want to feel a little bit sexy a little bit that I have something going on. When I see the models on Instagram coming up in all the swimsuit campaigns that have either breast augmentations or much more going on up here than I do I really don't get a sense of how the bikini is going to fit on me. I did get everything in my my true size which is extra small but I am a little bit worried that the bottoms might be a little bit too small for me and that maybe I should have gone with the small as my hips after having children have definitely expanded but also as I work on my booty gains my butt's getting a little bit bigger too so we'll see how much coverage I can get out of the extra small bottoms I might have to go in and exchange them for smalls now online all of the swimsuits do come in a variety of colors and I know that online right now the swimsuits are on a massive sale this summer I'll be wearing my bathing suits at the splash park with my kids at the swimming pools or just hanging out in my backyard while my kids and dog are running around. All right, let's get into it. The first swimsuit I snagged is the Airy Crinkle Ring Bandeau Top. Straight out of the bag, I'm a little disappointed because I'm seeing now that there's no adjustment on it. It actually just slips on over your head and then you kind of got to hope that it stays in place. It does come with straps, so you can wear it as a bikini with strap top or as a bandeau. Love this pink ring detail here, really beautiful. And I love kind of the contrast between the red and the pink. The color here is called Resort Red, which I love, and I wish I was wearing it to a resort, but sadly not. In line, I did read that, you know, they're trying to be a little bit more sustainable and not providing the bra pads. Probably keeping in mind that not everyone wants to wear them, but as you guys know, I always need bra pads pads because otherwise this will not look flattering on me. I am going to have to snag them from another bikini because they were not available online to purchase when I placed my order. I do believe they are available for purchase now. So it's got this fun little crinkly texture on it, which I really like. Also does say that it is UPF 50, which is really nice. I mean, not that it's going to be covering much anyways, but always nice when the material does have that. And to go with it, I did get the Airy Crinkle full coverage bottom. So 
So you can mix and match bottoms. You know, they have cheeky, they have ones with a tie. So I did get full coverage here in size extra small. Nothing crazy. It's a really basic bottom. No fancy patterns or anything like that. We are going to try this on and give it a go. Right, so here is the resort red bandeau. Now, again, I got my true size extra small. I have no idea who else this would fit. It's too small for me up here, which says a lot because on a good day, I'm a 32B. So this is without any removable bra pads. The amount of material right here is, is quite small. Now this could be a good bathing suit top if you frequently just lay out to get a tan because then so you're not going to get tan lines or anything like that. I'm brown. I don't really lay out in the sun to tan. This one's not going to do it for me. If I lift my arms up, I can feel it budging just a little bit. Again, it's not adjustable. So I did just slide it on right over my head. I feel like if it stretches out, it'll eventually start slipping down. Let me put some removable bra pads in here that I have from another bikini and see if that helps. It's a little bit better. It feels a little snugger with the addition of the bra pads in. I don't feel like it's going anywhere. I probably don't have a need for this style of bikini this year. I definitely was hoping it would be a little bit wider. But I think this one might be a return for me. Let me know what you guys think about this one. I do love the resort red color. I don't have a red bikini. It's not digging the style. Now for the bottoms, like I mentioned, it's just a regular style bikini bottom, not adjustable, no ties, nothing like that. I do like to wear them a little bit higher on my hip. This is what it looks like lower down, not really my style, a little bit higher up, feel a little bit more comfortable. I did get an extra small. I probably could do with a small because it is cutting in just a little bit in the back. It's not super uncomfortable and I like that there's no gaping at the band right here. So I feel super comfortable in the bottom, but unfortunately I think with the top, this one is gonna be a return. Next up, I have a similar style. This is so cute. I do not own a purple bikini right now, but I'm loving this style. So this is very similar to the last one, although it does have wide straps. It's called the Airy Crinkle Ring Wide Strap Scoop Bikini Top. What I love about this is the contrast in that lime green ring at the front. I think it's so adorable. Really basic bikini. It doesn't have any adjustment of the straps or on the back. So I am going to have to slip this on over my head. And once again, there is a slot here to insert removable bra pads, but it did not come with it. So you do need to purchase that separately. This is a pretty basic bikini. If there are days that I need to be getting into the pool, going down the water slide with my kids, I'll 100% be wearing this style of bathing suit because it like Likely won't go anywhere but we will see once I try it on for the bottoms I again did get the full coverage bikini just in the same matching solar violet color again this is extra small it is full coverage in the butt I have nothing against wearing thongs or anything like that but again if I'm going down the water slide if I'm at the splash park with my kid no one needs to be seeing my ass that's uh, your style you do you no judgment but for me my kids don't need to see my ass hanging out I'm feeling pretty good about about this one. This one is itty bitty enough for me, but I still feel like I have enough coverage that I can be running around at the splash park after my kids without my top coming down. Same thing, this one was not adjustable, so I did slip it on right over my head. But with the nice thick straps here, I just feel like it definitely feels secure. It's in place, it's not digging, and it's a very, very stretchy material. Seriously, so out of breath. Now this is without removable wrap pads, and I actually feel okay about it. And the bottoms are the same as the resort red bottoms. They just slip on. They're not adjustable. They are extra small. I feel like they have enough coverage that I'm not exposing too much when I'm chasing after my tots. But yeah, really liking this one. Let me know what you think about the color, but I think I'm digging it. Next up, I have the Airy Crinkle Lightly Lined Underwire Bikini Top. Really, really cute. Uh, this is in the color Springs. It is the crinkle, but if you look really closely, it actually has some shimmer to it which is really beautiful. Uh, it's really fun. It kind of gives it a sexy, fun look. Now, the difference with this bikini is that it is adjustable fully. We have the back closure. You can adjust it to three different sizes here. And the straps itself are also adjustable. So it does have that, you know, bra look to it. I will say that the cups are lined, but there is no option to insert additional pads. And I'm telling you right now, when I look at this, I can tell that I will not fill this out at all. But that's fine. I got what I got and I just don't think this one will work which is too bad because I did get the cheeky bottom matching with this set. Extra small here is gonna fit me perfectly because there are adjustable ties on the side. You can see it's not gonna be covering much. I will try this on so you can take a peek. 
I'm a little disappointed that the top probably won't fit me because I really like the shimmery look to this. It's really beautiful and super fun for summer. I'm sure if it catches the light in the sun, it would look really cool at the pool. No big deal. I'm gonna give it a go and see how this works for me. And right away, I know that this is gonna be a return for me. I knew it as soon as I took it out of the bag. So I don't have enough up here to fill out these cups, as cute as it is. Um, you can see it's actually gaping right here. I don't have enough upper boob here. What I did wanna talk about is the bottom. So this is an alternative bottom that you can mix and match with the tops, which I love. So this is the cheekiest of them, and I believe it is the least amount of coverage. So it is tied at the side so you can adjust it. I do like pulling it up on my hips. I think it's a cute look. I'm not gonna fully turn around, but it is cheeky. So it's not a thong, but it's kind of going halfway up my butt here. Yeah, I mean, I'm so comfortable wearing this up around my kids, around other kids. I don't feel like it's like a thong where, you know, too much is jiggling or anything like that. I think if you have a little bit more going on up here than 100% sexy bikini, really, really cute, really good support and fully adjustable in the back. If you are looking for a little bit more support, then 100% grab this one because there is the underwire. Just like I said, this is extra small and I don't even have enough to fill it out. So there you go. Moving away from the crinkle fabric now, I have the Airy Wide Rib String Triangle Bikini Top. I love a classic bikini top because I feel like it's sexy without moving too much. If again, I'm going down a water slide or you know playing water guns with my kids at the splash park. It does have the tie back and the tie neck. And again, there is the slot to insert your own removable bra pads. And I did get the bottoms to match and this is the cheeky kind. So the airy wide rib low rise cheeky bottom. Now this is low rise, but it's looking, I'm not sure it's gonna sit on me. It actually is looking like it sits pretty high. I'm hoping it's not low rise because I don't really do low rise anymore, given that I have wider hips and I just don't love the look of low rise on me because of my body type, but we're gonna see how it sits on me. I love this bright, bright pink color. My kids will definitely be able to see me wherever I am. This is in the color Coral Sun. All right, I think this is the ultimate string bikini. I love the contrast of the hot pink with kind of the cream color. It is just a regular string bikini, so it is really, really stretchy, really adjustable, ties in the back around the neck. I did put removable bra pads in because without it, triangle bikinis just don't look great on me. The cheeky bottom is somehow even cheekier than the blue one I just had on. So it does show a little bit of my butt here. I'm not gonna turn fully around, but it is fully adjustable. Again, I do like to pull this up to my hips. There is no gaping here, which is nice. This was the one that was labeled as low rise. So I guess if you wanted to wear it low rise, it would look more like this. But again, I prefer it a little bit higher up here. There is the pretty detail here. No really digging here. So the triangles are a good size. I hate when they're really, really small and then it's just uncomfortable and then you're always wondering if your nipple's showing. Yeah, overall, really, really cute bikini. Let me know your thoughts about this one. If it's a keep or return kind of on the fence. I needed a new simple black bikini. When I go for new digitals or for castings, they require you to wear a simple black bikini just so they can see your body type. And I've been wearing the same black bikini every time and it hasn't, it doesn't fit me the greatest, but I haven't been able to justify purchasing a new one. However, I did notice that this one was on sale, so I snagged it and it is just a basic triangle black bikini. I really like it. This one actually comes with removable pads, which is great. I could probably utilize this in the other swimsuits, tie neck, tie back, and then the bottoms are tied on the side. So I will try this on for you as well. If what you're going for is just a simple um, triangle black bikini, then hopefully this one will work for you. Yes, this is what the plain black bikini looks like. Just the regular triangle and tie bottom. This is a really great black simple bikini, really comfortable. Again, it is quite cheeky. But you can't go wrong, especially if you like simple, if you like black. And again, this is an extra small. The last thing I purchased here is the Airy Pool to Party Linen shirt and high waist short and I bought it in the color coral. It's just a really lightweight linen. I think there are multiple ways you can wear it. I mean you can mix and match. I can wear just the shorts if I want to. We've got some pockets and I mean the waist looks a little bit small. I did get the size extra small but like I said you can mix and match and wear one or the other. It is just a really great cut cover up for those days that get a little bit chilly or even just a little bit too sunny and I don't want to have my shoulders exposed. 
exposed. Right. Need we talk about these shorts? They are so soft. They have pockets, which is perfect for all the crap that my kids will make me carry around in the pool. Definitely hits um, above the belly button. I'd say this is like a little bit snug. I know that it's gonna leave little marks here. So again, something to keep in mind if you're gonna be wearing this and then taking it off to go into the pool, you'll likely have like the little indents here from this. So this is snug. I could probably size up to a small if I want a more oversized look. Really, really soft. I mean, it's obviously see-through. It is a really thin linen, but that's exactly what I want for when I'm outside with my kids. Something like this is perfect for when I'm just out. I want to have my bikini on. I don't want to get too hot. So you can wear it open like this, so cute. It is long, it hits just below my butt. So if even if I wasn't wearing the shorts, which I'll take off, you can see it's a great cover up, covers my butt. And if I wanted to, I could also tie it up in the front because the way it's cut, you can see here, very versatile. And then you can have it tied up like this, so cute. I mean, I suppose I could also do it up, but I feel like it might look like pajamas. All right, friends, that is it. We have reached the end of our area haul. I will say that I did have a few airy swimsuits from the last summer and they held up really really well. So no stretching, no loss of the pigment in the fabric. I highly highly recommend airy. Definitely affordable bathing suits, good quality that are really versatile pieces and that you can wear year after year. Be sure to like and subscribe. We talk all things wellness and fitness and how I fit it into my schedule as a mom of two kids. I'm wishing you all an amazing day. Hoping for sunny days ahead and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching.